roughly eight technicians, and it's very easy to uh, uh, to make it fly between two flights. You know, it's very quick, and we need a small team to do so. Have you found any combat mission? Yeah, with the Rafale, yeah. and uh, we are uh, both former uh, Mirage pilot. Mirage F1 for me and Mirage C5 for a member. So we did an uh, operation over uh, Syria, Libya, Iraq, Africa, and uh, as I said, it's uh, very uh, easy to use uh, for bombing, for air defense. We can do uh, every kind of uh, mission. Uh, it does close air support, sure. It's the main mission uh, in uh, Iraq and uh, how Syria. Is, how yeah. is counting the S400 system with Rafale? Uh, yeah. Can you tell me something? Uh, if, if, if I say, what, what, what's your question? I will not shoot you. S400, you're flying in the area, they have, for example, the S400 air defense system. Yeah. Is it easy to count? Yeah, it, 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 a bit, uh, bit difficult uh, as a trainee pilot, young pilot, but uh, when you uh, uh, when you have experience, it's very easy to use. So uh, I said before that the system is a OTA system, is hand on throttle and sticks. You can do everything with your hands on the, the two sticks because we have many uh, buttons, many switches on the sticks, and you can just fly it like this and manage everything on the displays uh, with your hand. So you need time at the beginning as a trainee, but after that, uh, it's very easy to use. Okay, that's another question. Your name, did you have some, so many snaps or, <laughs> or about my uh, yeah. call time? <laughs> Explain why. Why? Yeah, because... Uh, I have another uh, passion, I have uh, another job, I'm ski instructor. And shoes is the uh, skiing position to go fast. Okay. <laughs> to go fast, so it's the shoes. <laughs> what, what is my uh, nickname? Okay. Can you elaborate a bit on the capabilities of the Spectra system? Uh, Spectra system, it's a uh, so self-defense uh, system, is uh, linked with uh, every sensor of uh, the aircraft, with the radar, with many sensors, and what is uh, very good for us is the main computer of the fighter shows the best, uh, the best uh, uh, information to show us the information, because the, the computer uh, make a link with all the sensors and the pilot has only one uh, response of all the sensors. So very easy to use, we let the system do and we wait the information to uh, react. Uh, the, the fighter can react itself or with uh, the action of the pilot. One of the strengths of the aircraft is actually the sensor function, you know? And what the shoes will uh, show us today is the maneuverability, the extreme maneuverability, which is one of the strengths. But the uh, combat system, of course, will not show you during a display, but just be it's uh, very accurate. And for us pilots, it's very friendly to use. We still have a head up display. Do you have a helmet? Not yet. In France, no, but uh, other countries uh, have the helmet. Qatar, for example. Yes, for the Rafa. Yeah, I guess so. Um, maybe you can ask to that so because it's yeah, yeah, yeah. But for us, we will have it uh, soon. So. Yeah. Uh, so, many active uh, I, I can speak uh, too much about uh, it, but uh, uh, for a very uh, technical uh, answer, uh, maybe. Sure, we, we love to fly this aircraft. 
for us pilots. Again, user friendly, uh, omni roll mission, heavy loads, heavy endurance. That's, yeah, the, that's, that's what's making the difference. Many times we can compare with our friendly uh, country uh, during training. And uh, for the mission, every time we stay uh, a longer time in flight uh, compared to uh, the other, thanks to uh, the fuel tanks and uh, the good uh, uh, endurance of the fight. How long do you usually stay as a display pilot? How many years? Yeah, it's two two years as a display pilot, and then two years as the, the coach uh, to uh, train the, the new one. So it's four years. Uh, in, the, in fact, the, the two shoes. jobs for for shoes, which is the new pilot, you will only have to fly the aircraft as a demo. I won't fly the demo anymore for the two next years, but I will take care of the team. And I will take care of the coordinations with the organizers and uh, with the, uh, the, the headquarters. And he won't, won't have to, uh, to manage that. So we'll focus only on this flight. That's what we want. So, uh, so two years, two years. How, the how are the display pilots chosen? Yes. First, I want to be uh, the, the pilot first. So uh, the French Air Force shoes uh, from the Rafale uh, pilot came first. Uh, minimum 500 hours uh, in this uh, fighter and uh, four ship lead as a qualification. So this is the minimum uh, requesting to be the display pilot. And then. Uh, many things, uh, uh, the headquarters uh, choose uh, some guys and then the previous pilot choose uh, uh, who can be the, the good guy and so on. So uh, there is uh, many steps before the uh, issues of that. Uh, you have to be experienced, right. so four ship lead. You have to have minimum uh, flying hours on the aircraft and you have to be chosen by the previous pilot and by the headquarters. So these are the requirements. And in short, we are all former uh, frontline uh, pilots. So we did operations so very, uh, very Do you usually come from the same squadron or different squadron? No, different squadron, it, it depends. Uh, in France, uh, there are two bases with the uh, Rafale. Saint Didier, north east of France, and Montmartre, south west of France. And uh, you, you, the team is at Saint Didier, north east. Uh, I was pilot on the south west of France. So I, uh, I went to uh, Saint Didier to the pilot. Yeah, but we were on the same squadron, uh, the we Tiger were Squadron before, 170. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Well, well, yeah. <laughs> you, you know the Tiger Squadron? Yeah, yeah I know. Yeah. So we were our Tigers, both of us, oh, and okay. we spent uh, one, one year together at the 170. Yeah. But okay. before that, it was on uh, Mirage F1, and I was on Mirage 2000. Oh, okay. So we know each other. The community is uh, quite small, so you know, so right. everybody knows each other, and uh, that's why we, we can choose. Yeah. So uh, how long does it take to learn the display for the year, and, and who is planning it? So first, uh, end of uh, the previous uh, year, it's a physical training, just uh, physically, and we uh, prepare uh, the next uh, show. So I draw my uh, spaghetti uh, to do what, what I will do uh, next year. And Fabuk uh, give me some, uh, some advice and so on to uh, prepare it. Then I train on the simulator, and after that is uh, 30 flights. Uh, to train so the flight. After the 30 flights, uh, there is a validation with the, uh, the staff of the French at the French Air Force, and then we begin the, the air show season uh, yeah. after that. How has it been this year because of the COVID? Yeah, so we kept the training uh, in March, the uh, then we uh, begin again uh, in the beginning of uh, May. May yeah. Uh, May and uh, so uh, there are a lot of solutions, uh, air uh, solutions. So uh, I continue to train uh, for my body and to keep uh, the endurance to do the job. And uh, we, so today is our first uh, event of the year.
official event. We did an event in the, uh, the airport, but first a uh, uh, civilian uh, airport. That was a difficult planning because he has, as he said, he has to fly at least two, two trainings per week to be accurate and safe, you know. And we had always uh, air shows planned, so as long as we have air shows planned, we have to train. So that's why, in fact, we did, uh, I, don't, I don't know how many uh, flights, but uh, two, two per year. Yeah, I did for a week see, uh, since it's May. Right, so. It's very uh, physically demanding. Yeah, I guess. yeah, extreme. Because, because you have to train. Yeah, yeah, yeah. extreme. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So how do you train? With uh, a special uh, physical coach. So a guy uh, made training for me uh, three days per week uh, to train the physical. So uh, it's one that, as I said, for a young pilot. Uh, uh, I said uh, the display first, uh, it's physical training first, and then technical uh, with the flight. Right. Uh, very important. Yes. So how old are you? I'm uh, 39. 39? Yes. So you're not so young anymore. The, yeah. <laughs> so the, the, the physical part must be, it must be even harder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For, the, for uh, like 20 something. It's, much easier. Yeah, sure. But you, sure, but you need uh, experience. So it's why experience. we begin right. at 38, 39. Yeah. Uh, Babuk has 40. Yeah. Yeah, so it's why it's. Uh, because you have to know the safety. Issues yeah, and sure. Stuff, yeah, so. exactly. Yeah. Okay. Well, yeah. So thank you very much. You're welcome. So Good enjoy fun. the flight at 3:45. Uh, we are still uh, here. We have this uh, press all the time. Okay. Uh, how do you operate the force with the central display and two forward display? Yeah, no information we get the central one. Central uh, is the public display plus uh, the radar gate, okay? And you have some stick uh, information. And both of the this one on one side is for uh, to manage uh, the fighter, so it can be a uh, uh, two uh, hydraulic and so on. Yes, plus select uh, uh, the, the mode uh, you fly, so air to air mode, uh, air to ground mode, and so on. And you have many changes, so you can choose how you want to do it. So it's such a simple thing. It's a big one, and you can use it in a lot of ways. So you can charge it, it's created like a lot of things, so you can see that in the day. How do you guys approach it? Yes, yes, it, it's uh, sorry. Uh, uh, suppression, uh, suppression of enemy air defense. Oh, yeah, yes, yes. 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 Uh, it's like uh, a very big uh, screen. We yes. need yes. armament. So, you yeah, so? screen, uh, we need a uh, red coordinate. Uh, and, uh, uh, and, uh, yeah. and we need uh, armament so we will uh, catch uh, the uh, emission of the uh, enemy radar to do so. Yeah. So, this is a very specific.